So now we'll see the art materials for watercolor painting. This is Bristol A3 size 300 GSM watercolor sheets. So these are uh, sheets that you get separately in uh, a specific quantity. And if you want to buy a watercolor pad, this is another example of watercolor paper. This is 200 GSM A3 size, another brand, Anupam brand. So you get uh, both the brands you get um, both 200 and 300 GSM this is like a pad so all the sheets are uh, uh, stuck inside on one side I prefer Brustro the quality of Brustro papers is much better compared to Anupam so you can try out and decide this is a 0.5 mm pencil which I use for my drawing very lightly eraser a clean one and you will need some waterproof pens so this one is uh, 1 mm uh, main what you have to see over here is waterproof pen. This is another brand, Bistro brand. This is 0.5 mm and you can uh, check the links. I will be sending the links. So in the art material list you can check. This is Sakura white jelly roll pens. So there are uh, a pack of three of different sizes. You can even buy a single white pen if you need. You don't need to buy all three, but depends on what you want. These are watercolors. These are camel watercolors. This is a set of 24 shades. And uh, this is, each one is 5 ml cube. And we have one more uh, set of camel. This is the earlier one which I used to use. This is 9 ml. The tubes were a little bigger than that, and even the shades 24 shades was 18 shades, number of shades was less. Recently, I have got the Bistro Artist Watercolor, these are 24 shades, 12 ml each. So, I will show you these. I found the quality of uh, Bistro products better, and the texture of the paints is also better. These are quite good. So when you paint, use the paint, you will find a difference. But for start off, you can even use camel. Camel is also quite good enough. I have been using camel for quite some time. And they last really long. This is my empty box. I have used to keep these tubes. These tubes you get separately also. So these are um, 60 ml tubes. So in, in case uh, you need a specific color, uh, which is over in your box, but you don't want to buy the whole box, you can buy these separately. And, um, big art stores or big stationery stores. You won't get it in smaller shops and uh, price is also quite reasonable if you want to buy single color shades. It's quite good. You don't need to buy the whole box again. These are the brushes that I have been using. 8 number, 4 number and 0 number which are the main ones I use. And one flat brush is what I use. It's 14 number. You can use any synthetic brushes for this. Uh, good quality. And this is a new set which I have bought recently. I will share the link. I bought this from Amazon. I found this product really good. These are uh, pretty good quality uh, in terms of the wood used and the length. You know, these are long handle brushes. So it's very good to uh, color. You get more flexibility, more area can be covered with these brushes. So if you are... Um, Comfortable with long handle brushes, I would recommend you that you use these. Even the holding capacity is quite good. So these are more like, you know, mop brushes. They have quite a good holding capacity of the paint and water. And uh, it's written here that you can use it for oil, acrylic, water, all. But yeah, you can use for any, but one set of brushes for one medium. Don't mix your brushes for all the mediums. If you are using it for watercolor, don't use it for acrylic or oil. So that's it. Check the links and you can take. Thank you.